Tonight, COVID-19 and supply chain disruptions creating a shocking situation at a Metro grocery store. Many of you are posting online surprised to find your favorite snacks out of stock and shelves empty at stores. And it appears the restock struggle isn't getting better either. Just today, Walmart announced the temporary closure of three local stores. Alan Devlin live tonight at one of those locations in Duluth and Allen. These stores will not open for another couple of days. Yeah, Sean, you know, it's an interesting site. Normally on a normal day, this Walmart would be closed regardless. But take a look at the empty parking lot here. Nothing abnormal except for the fact that it's looked like this since 2 o'clock today. That is when Walmart first announced it was going to be closing three different locations. They won't be opening up until Saturday morning. And COVID-19 is to blame. It seems as though lately when I come, a lot of things are not on the shelves. Stores across Atlanta filled with empty shelves, even closing over COVID. Walmart confirmed it's closed three local stores, one in Noonan, one in LaGrange, and one here in Duluth. This will allow extra time for a third-party specialist to further sanitize the stores and will also give our associates additional time to restock shelves and prepare the store to once again serve the community. In other stores... Shortages in terms of availability of workers, both to produce product as well as to distribute it, are causing some of the supply chain imbalances to be harder to rectify than they might be if labor markets were more cooperative. Supplies of many essentials, including meat, fruits, and vegetables, slim to none at some local grocery stores. So I just have to, you know, come every, you know, pretty often to see to get the items that I need. Former Atlanta Mayor Bottoms took to Twitter to point out the shortage, saying she can't seem to find the groceries she's looking for at this Cascade Road Publix. These are not normal times. The good news, experts believe with time, the chain and workforce will catch up and those shelves won't be empty for long. It's like never ending. It's always just something. So again, 6 a.m. Saturday morning is when most of these Walmarts will reopen. For those of you who are using the pharmacies at these three locations, you can still call your local Walmart and access the medications that you need. Live in Duluth, Alan Devlin, CBS 46 News.